Hello, I'm Guy Selger from touringplans.com here today with a Disney theme park merchandise unboxing and review. Today, this, this is the second in the series of Haunted Mansion stretching room statues. And we got the three guys that are sinking in quicksand. So, got the Disneyland 60 bag right here. Take it out of the bag. We have a black Art of Disney theme park box. The previous statue in this series came in a plain white box. Really no frills. I don't even think there was a picture on it. This one has a picture of the statue and a little description. And then we got the price tag, $95. Comes out to around $82 after annual pass discount. So a little pricey, but luckily the quality is on point. So I'll take it out of the box and uh, take a look at it. There it is inside, the styrofoam. Pretty well secured, wrapped in plastic. There's the actual statue. Wow, this looks really great. Really happy with this. Um, Let you guys get a look at it. Whoever sculpted these did a great job making these look exactly like the stretching room portrait paintings. These things are really well built, sturdy. There's nothing really cheap about them. The colors look great. The paint jobs are very detailed. You can even see the guy's little tie and buttons and everything. Yeah, this looks awesome. On the bottom, got the Haunted Mansion logo, authentic, like somebody would bootleg it. Art of Disney theme parks, Haunted Mansion stretch painting number two, made in China. And I will show it next to the first in the series, which was the tightrope walker. So we got the the color of the base is a, is different. This one's like a light brown. This one's almost kind of a burgundy. Same bottoms. And pretty much the same height. God, this is gonna look so cool when all of them are out next to each other. I don't remember when this one re was released. I wanna say last September. I'll have to, I'll include a video of that unboxing I did of this. But it's good to see them finally release number two in the series. The quicksand is like this murky kind of green. Looks really good. Overall, really happy with this. Like I said, a little expensive, but the quality is totally on point. And Everybody loves the stretching room portraits, right? In Haunted Mansion, like there's a ton of Haunted Mansion fans out there and it's kind of one of the most like, iconic parts of the ride. So to have these like realized in three dimensions is really cool, especially just with the level of detail. Anyway, not too much else to say about this. Got this in Disneyland at World of Disney in downtown Disney. It wasn't in Disney Anna on Main Street yet, but they said it was coming at some point. And I'm sure it'll show up at Disney World if it hasn't already. But that's it for this time. Thanks for watching. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.